in this quick tutorial you will learn how to take png canva mockup template and turn them into smart object based photoshop mockup template there are two big advantages of changing your canva mockup template to smart object photoshop templates first is the smart object template is quicker to edit and apply your designs to second is that with smart object template you can automate your workflow and create hundreds of mockup in batches this will save you a lot of time so without wasting any time let's jump on the tutorial these are three canva templar mockup that i have i'll open it in photoshop if you look at the center there is some kind of transparency it does look like a templar now let us see how we can change this template into a smart object based template the process is very simple step is grab one of your design element as a placeholder uh, maybe we'll pick up this design grab and place it onto this file click on this check mark now press control t or command t make this big hit enter next step would be press and hold control on your keyboard or if you're in mac hold command key and then take your mouse onto this layer and left click it once you left click you could see a highlight around the design next turn off this visibility layer and onto this layer panel click on create a new layer this creates a new layer go to edit fill and fill it with any color maybe blue okay and hit on okay to deselect the highlights press control d or command d next step would be right click and click on convert to smart object now you may go ahead and delete this design layer next grab this layer 2 and pull this below layer 1 next press control t you can look at the bounding box of your design now make it smaller and try to fit in the space that is left out by the transparency so i have placed it at the center next go to this and click on check mark now file save this file as a photoshop file dot psd click on save your file has been converted to a smart object template now to apply your design just go to layer 2 right click click on replace content and then select your design why that your design applied to this templar instantly there is a very common mistake you may fall for while creating smart object for your template let me show you so i have this template Now instead of following the steps I illustrated in the previous example you may be tempted to select this marquee selection make a selection around the tumbler create a new layer edit and fill it with color next press command T to deselect and then you can right click and click to convert to smart object next grab this layer 2 and place it beneath layer 1 This looks exactly the same that we did in the previous example except when I open this layer 2 the design element is too narrow so when you place your actual tumbler wraps this will not fit in properly as in if I drag and if I design and place it look the tumbler wrap does not fit properly into this narrow design hence you need to follow the steps that i illustrated in the previous example now let us take a look at a challenging example uh, for this there are two you know a transparent tumblers uh, so again first step would be uh, grab one of your design uh, place it in photoshop okay press control d or command d yeah you're in mac uh, and last this now hold control on your keyboard or commands then single left click on this icon okay uh, once you do that uh, the borders of the design will be highlighted turn off the design create a new layer by going here click on this simply create a new layer 
go to edit fill uh, select any color yeah purple looks good hit on ok all right now press command d this will deselect next layer to right click and click to convert to slot option perfect now you can delete this uh, design now take layer 2 and drag this below layer 1 now focus on only one tumbler there are two tumblers so either focus on the left one or on the right one press command d this will activate the anchor points of the design uh, i am now focusing on the right tumbler i'll decrease the size i'll try to match the center of the design uh, to the center of the tumbler so i think this looks good maybe i could uh, crop this a bit i uh, forget about this one on uh, the left tumbler once done hit on check mark so we have a smart object ready for this uh, right tumbler next grab this polygon lasso tool and try to make a selection around the right tumbler so make a selection uh, when you click the initial point it will make a selection now uh, press d on your keyboard or you change the foreground color to black uh, you could press d it will uh, change the color or just change the foreground color to black and then select layer 2 and click on this this is a layer mask button so what it does the white region is where we could see the color i mean uh, if i turn this off uh, the black part has been masked out and we could only see the uh, white part again turn this on now the next step is we will duplicate this layer 2 okay control j or command j select layer 2 and press command j uh, this will duplicate it uh, select this mask right click and click on delete layer mask okay and now turn off the visibility of layer 2 perfect now we already did a setting for the right tumbler now we should do it for the left tumbler press command t uh bring this on to the left uh go to the corners you'll find this two headed arrow click your mouse and rotate this and again try to match the center of the design with the center of the tumbler for left uh tumbler once done hit on this check mark perfect uh again take the polygon lasso tool try to make a selection around the left tumbler and hit on mask uh we could see that uh, we left out some design over here so again make a selection of this uh select this and edit fill black color okay so the fill the black color uh this will remove the extra part now press control the command d bring this back and now uh turn on this one now you can go ahead and rename any of the layer at the red design and save this as a psd file and it's done so this is how you create this template for this design if you change any changes onto this one like if i change it to black okay the both changes so same design will be applied to both of them and press command z to go back so this is how you prepare the template for uh, you know two designs and uh, to you know zoom in and zoom out uh, what you can do is uh, press option key on your keyboard and use the scroll button in your mouse the uh, this will help you zoom in zoom out okay now let us see how you can use this smart object based template and automate your mock up creation process to do that delete all the png templates from this folder i'll delete them so now we have three smart object based photoshop templates and in the design we have 10 items so to automate the process we'll use bulk mockup photoshop plugin bulk mockup photoshop plugin is a revolutionary tool that will help us to automate the mockup creation process let us see how it works 
So this plugin has three options. First is PST template folder. Hit on this three dot icons. Now navigate to your template folder. Click on this template. The next option is design files folder. Select your design folder. It has 10 items. Next we have export folder. We'll hit a new folder here. I'll name this export. Open. Next we have resize method. So we'll select fill canvas stretch. Next I'll hit on start generating button. Bulk mockup will automatically open the template and apply our design. Let us take a look at the export folder. Bulk mockup will cycle through all our template and apply 10 designs onto all of them. The exports are complete. Look at the quality of our exporter. If you want to learn more about bulk mockup, visit bulkmockup.com. If you like this video, do consider subscribing. Also visit our YouTube channel where you will find more YouTube tutorials like these.